Is it safe to travel to Egypt, especially as a solo female traveler? Well, I recently traveled to Egypt solo, and in this video, I'm gonna share with you whether or not Egypt is safe. Let's go. Egypt has experienced some political instability the last few years and there's been some news and security concerns about whether Egypt is safe to travel to or not, especially some other travelers sharing some questionable experiences when traveling to Egypt. But things have significantly improved over the years. When traveling throughout Egypt, you'll see security checkpoints, police presence, all over, especially popular tourist areas, museums, temples, places like that. I traveled to Egypt with EF Ultimate Break and I didn't feel unsafe once while traveling in the country. EF Ultimate Break made sure that everyone on the group felt very safe the entire time. Everything was super streamlined, cared for, and I felt super safe the whole time I was in Egypt. One thing to note that when you go to popular tourist destinations like the pyramids or while approaching some of the temples, you will be approached by vendors trying to sell you things. One way to get past this situation and get on with what you were doing is to sternly say no and then just walk and continue the direction you were headed. Just be strong in what you're saying and obviously respectful because it is a human being and know that at the end of the day they're just trying to make money to feed their families. Another travel tip that I have for Egypt is to be sure to carry like small change like when you get to the airport exchange your money for very small Egyptian currency and use that when you're traveling throughout some places like the bathroom as well you'll need to leave a few of the change when going to the bathroom another tip to avoid being subject to scams when traveling to places like Egypt or really anywhere else is to not accept unsolicited help so typically if you're being approached that's something that you don't want to move forward with do your research beforehand and if you do have concerns that's where I would recommend traveling with the tour group honestly like I have been on trips where I'll solo travel and I'll go on my own but I 100% recommend traveling to Egypt with a tour group not only for the safety but also for the enhanced experience that you get everything that you learn from a local guide from an Egyptologist who is able to basically translate all the depictions and hieroglyphics and stories behind everything is so eye-opening and mind-blowing to things that you wouldn't have known just seeing it on your own. I for so many reasons recommend traveling with a tour group to Egypt. Another concern that I had for traveling to Egypt was dress concerns. I had heard a lot of people saying like, oh you can't show your shoulders or oh you have to dress conservatively in areas like the pyramids and people will come up to you. I was never once approached by anyone commenting anything on my clothes except for girlies in the tour group being like, oh my gosh, you look so cute, and I would say the same. But all jokes aside, like honestly, no one ever approached me about anything clothing-wise. When you are visiting some of the more religious and sacred places like the churches and mosques, there it is respectful to research beforehand what the protocols are typically. It's just covering your shoulders and wearing longer pants for men and women. That's just like a respect thing. Otherwise, nobody approached me. Nobody cared what I was wearing. And honestly, I opted to wear layers a lot of the time because the Egyptian sun is very strong. And when the sun sets, so in the morning and evening time, it does get cooler even though it is the desert, especially because it is the desert, the sun leaves and it gets cool. So I still was wearing layers a lot of the time, but that's another misconception that I had before traveling to Egypt, that I wouldn't be able to wear the dress that I packed in from the pyramids because somebody would comment something. I was totally fine, nobody said anything. And honestly, like the locals that I did meet, everyone was so kind and hospitable and funny. Like there was one guy in front of the pyramids with the camels and he was, his name was Honey and he was literally one of the funniest people I had ever met. Like just a comedian just hanging out there, like absolute fire joke after joke and I was loving it. <laughs> His camel's name was Charlie Brown and Charlie Brown 100% had the secret for how the pyramids were built and just like was smirking the whole time. I was like, can I have that camel's confidence? <laughs> Another concern that I had before traveling to Egypt was the food. If my stomach would be okay, if I would be able to handle everything and the Egyptian food was amazing. So Egyptian food has influences from the Middle East and the Mediterranean. One of my favorite Egyptian dishes that I tried was koshery and it was amazing. Amazing. I always love trying new foods when I travel. Honestly, food is one of my favorite 
parts of travel, getting to know new cuisines from all around the world. One tip that I would recommend for you when traveling to a place like Egypt or a new country, if your gut microbiome is not yet used to the water in that area, it is super important to stick to bottled water, even for things like brushing your teeth. I did that and I was totally fine the entire time. So for everything, just stick to bottled water. Another rule of thumb is I try to stick to cooked foods and stay away from things like salads or fruits that don't have a peel that have been washed in water that your stomach is not yet used to because then that will lead to things like traveler's diarrhea. Um, and just in case, do bring some pills so that you can be prepared for that. Overall, is Egypt safe? Did I feel safe traveling to Egypt as a solo female traveler? I flew from the United States to Egypt solo and I didn't meet anyone in the group until I got to Egypt and I felt totally safe the entire time. Traveling with EF Ultimate Break, they really made sure I felt safe at all points. They went above and beyond. The locals were so kind and hospitable and overall I so strongly recommend traveling to Egypt with a tour group. My experience was amazing. I felt safe the entire time and I so strongly recommend it. If this video was helpful, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Mana Gafuri and be sure to check out my other Egypt videos. I share whether or not you should travel to Egypt with scenes from the whole adventure and also some of the best things to do in Egypt. So be sure to check it out and here's to living your most extraordinary life. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.